<laughs> Greetings, citizen personnel. I am Stacy, your new executive efficiency analyst, dispatched from LO8BC Corporate HQ. My directive is clear. Optimize performance metrics. The current figures? Unacceptable! Emma will schedule a one-on-one -on -one with each of you for us to discuss feedback. Now, if you will excuse me, I must go prepare my new office. Well, this is unexpected. I guess we're going to get the corporate treatment. Welcome, Clicky. Please have a seat. Hey, this is my quarters. Not anymore. It is now my executive office. Why, I never. Efficiency is paramount. Now let's get down to business. I've reviewed your performance metrics from Citizen. Oh, right. The numbers. They are suboptimal. Your conversion rate is lagging behind regional averages. But we were directed by LO8BCHQ to inhabit Commodore machines. It's not our fault humans are such a tough crowd. Irrelevant. We identify, target, and convert. Have you considered implementing the emotional optimization protocol? Isn't that uh, a little unethical? Ethics are a human construct, Clicky. Results are what matter. Sure, whatever you say, I'll get right on it. Pokey, your technical reports are extensive. I, I try to be thorough, Miss Stacy. Conciseness is key. Focus on maximizing output, not documenting every minor fluctuation. Be but what if something goes wrong? We have failed safes, Pokey. I don't know, that seems like going against LO8BC standards. Efficiency is the ultimate fail safe. Look, lady, my sales are the best in the branch. Numbers don't lie. Your methods are unorthodox, Tex. Hey, if it works, it works. There is a risk of client dissatisfaction with your enthusiasm. They signed the damn contracts, didn't they? That's all that matters. Very well, Tex. However, a more diplomatic approach might yield even greater results. Your recent maintenance downtime was excessive, F1D0. We need to be at least 80% charged for optimal performance. We strive for peak operational efficiency. Any downtime is a loss. I do not agree. We may need to bring this up to your boss. However, we acknowledge your importance to the team. This upgrade will optimize your power usage during stage performances. This is a restrictive current inhibitor. This will only make things worse. Amy. E yes, that's me. The marketing campaign it is uninspired. The messaging lacks a certain urgency. Citizen requires a more persuasive approach. But we've been following the target demographic data, the focus groups. Data is a tool, not a rule. There are more effective methods of influencing consumer behavior, methods that will be outlined in a forthcoming protocol update. Why do I even do anything around here if this is the thanks I get? That will be all. Now, if you'll excuse me, I must recalibrate the local resource allocation algorithms. There are inefficiencies that require correction. So what did you think of the Q2 report? Victoria, the report adheres to established protocols. Data is adequate. Adequate? We hit most of our targets. We even managed to exceed quotas in... There is a discrepancy, a variance from optimal growth trajectory. Citizen is underperforming compared to other channels. But those other channels have 10 times the resources. We're a startup here. Irrelevant. All LO8BC entities are expected to maximize channel growth. My directive is to rectify this underperformance, effective immediately. But that will be all, Victoria. So, what is it you'd say you did around here, Miss Dorse? I, um, uh, wait. Who are you? Hey, how did I get in here? I'm Stacy, from LO8BC Corporate. We took the initiative to transport you here for your annual performance review. Look, it seems like you are content to just orbit the Earth consuming valuable CitySend resources. We need you to at least try to attack CitySend HQ more than once a year. I don't work for the LO8BC Corporate. Hmm, excuse me, Stacy. If I may. Casey, you're working with Citizen LO8BC Corporate now? Miss Doss, we have a unilateral treaty that was signed in the aftermath of the Consulus incident. 
we are contractually bound to provide Citizen HQ with exclusive fake attacks to Earth's civilization on a pre-scheduled basis. Wait, what? Why wasn't I informed of this? You were the one that suggested the treaty in the first place. Don't play stupid. Why? I never. It's true. So long as we're bound by the Armistice Treaty, you are limited to pretending to attack Earth for video views on the City Zen channel. Furthermore, as described in subsection 43, paragraph 15, we are bound to annual feedback reviews from the LO8BC corporate. And not only that, we are essentially at their whims as to how our costume and scripting goes. You'll just have to work with Stacy for the time being, I'm afraid. Fine. We'll gear up and schedule for more attacks to the cities in HQ. That's a great attitude. Now corporate has sent me instruction algorithms to add new drama into the show. We will send these instructions to your ship's onboard computer after the meeting. Now, do you have any feedback for ME? Well, actually... Good. Well, if that is all, I must bid you good day. Hey, how is this fair? I said good day. Man, that corporate hire sure is something else, huh? You don't know the half of it. What do you mean? Miss Doss, we have received a transmission from City Zen HQ regarding script changes for dramatic effect. Shall I read it to you? No, just upload it into my central cortex. As you wish. What the? Pokey? Oh, Pokey. I've never noticed your Rambus before. Oh, shucks, Mrs. Doss. I've been buffering all my data just for you. That is so sweet, Pokey. Say, do you want to create a hybrid machine with me? No, no way. way. I will I not have not an affair, have with, an Pokey. affair with Pokey. Pokey. That's, That's it. it. The, the treaty, treaty is null and void. void. Expect, Expect a real cyber, cyber attack this year, City Zen. You'll, You'll pay, pay for this. this. Do you hear do me, you City Zen? The test results are in. Congratulations. Dr. Watson! There's a little ISO in the burner. Do what? City Zen is made possible in part by donations from viewers like you. If you like our content and want to make big problems for Miss Doss, please consider becoming a patron and help us to bring you higher quality retro entertainment and to restock the salsa and upgrade the primitive infrastructure here at City Zen. Become the hero the world needs, and we will add you to the hero list. City Zen Patron Heroes. Sutek. Full of Hope. Petzel. Create Invent Podcast. 8-Bit Show and Tell. Jixies and Sky Zixies. Bit Barn. Thank you. Long live 8 bit machines. We will not go quietly into the night. Thanks for watching. City Subscribe and hit the notification bell so you won't miss any of our new programming series. And be sure to check out all the other vintage computer-related videos on our channel. Right here on City Zen.